and welcome back to my channel. Um, it's been a while. Um, it's been a while since I've done a sit down video because I've been busy with Christmas and New Year and I've pretty much been ill ever since. I've had two or three rounds of antibiotics, two or three rounds of steroid medication and I'm still ill. Um, but much much better than I have been and hopefully that is it done and dusted hopefully um so today's video as you can see by the title is a book review i have read about five books so far this year and i thought i would do a review of so far and that is why mummy drinks this book is by an author called jill sims heard a lot about this book and it's taken me a long time to get round to it, but I am so, so glad that I did. It is a laugh out loud, hilarious, absolutely hilarious. It's very um, Bridget Jones kind of style. So one of the aspects of this book that I found really, really, really fun to read about was the the sense of community among mums um, and all of those mums who have this perception of everyone's perfect um, and even the mums that look like they totally have everything organised and all there together, um, you don't. And that's one of the great things about this book. It isn't sugarcoating the perfect world of being a mum. It is showing and sh demonstrating the highs and the lows, the, the joys and the times when we all want to scream and shout and tell them all the little basically. Uh, I think the funniest part about this book is that while Ellen's bored at work and when she's out um, having a drink with her friends and putting all the worlds to rights, she comes up with this crazy idea to develop an app, um, a game called Why Mummy Drinks. And it's a daft game and she doesn't think anything from it. And the next thing you know, it blows up. It becomes extremely popular. Everybody has the app. Everybody's playing the app. And that's kind of what brings all these different families together. And it's the... It's 100% hilarious. It's the way that it's written. Um, I like the fact that it's British as well. It's British humour. Um, but also anyone can read it and understand um, the struggles of being a parent. In some senses, this is almost like reading Ellen's journal. Um, when she sits down every evening to have her glass of wine and kind of like just reflect on how the day's been, what's been going on, what made her crazy, what made her proud. Um, but it is just written in such a funny way. 100% um, if you're a mum, you've got to read this. It will give you proper laugh out loud giggles. It had me laughing pretty much the whole way through it. Um, I love the way... There's a part in the book where um, she takes her son out um, and he gets, when they get home, her son initially, her son then initially starts winding up the daughter, saying, um, I've been out, I was allowed cake, you didn't get it. Um, at that point, the daughter is, you know, pretty much upset and screaming and the siblings have their sibling fight. She tells Peter he's adopted. And the mum's kind of got to go in, break it up and defuse the situation. And then when that's all sorted, she kind of sits down and thinks, oh, fuck my life. Um, but yeah, it is an amazing book. I would give it, actually, I'd give it a 10 out of 10. It's absolutely fantastic. Um, Jill Sims is the author and she has another book out, um, I think of the same series. And the next one is called why mummy swears and that is literally the next book that i am going to be reading i've enjoyed this one so much that i can't wait to read the next one um so yeah if you haven't read this book before or you're just wondering if it's worth buying it or even if you're going if you've got a library and you just 
go and borrow the book. 100% it is worth a read. And it's not a massively long book. Um, it won't take ages for you to read it. It's, it's not a hard read. It's a hilarious read. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Um, and let's say I've read about five books so far this year. Um, while I've been so ill, I've not been that fussed about watching programmes and doing too much, um, even being out of focus on doing the, um, this, a YouTube video for you guys. Um, so I've kind of just tried to rest and I've been reading while I'm resting. And yeah, out of the, all the books I've read so far this year, this is by far the best. And I cannot wait to read Why Mummy Swears, which is the next one in the series. Um, so yeah, if you're thinking about getting this book, do it. Just get it. You will love it. Um, and yeah, uh, that's it from me today. Um, short video, I know. But yeah, this is just my thoughts on an awesome book from this year. And in comment down below um, what you're reading and your thoughts on books that you have read. Um, that's it from me today. And I will speak to you all in the next video. Hopefully it won't be as long as the, this one has been. Um, hopefully that's me done with being as ill as I have been. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye guys. Music